Tell me a little bit about you know some of your experience. Go back to to that those those early years when you were learning leadership on the team and and how that all worked for you. Well, I, I worked. And I did, it wasn't work. I, I had an opportunity to play mm -hmm. for a man by the name of Pete Newell, who was a, a brilliant coach. Um, uh, after we lost in the final game in 1960 to Ohio State uh, in basketball, by the way, yeah. uh, it, uh, uh, our coach retired and he became an athletic director. But he did coach one more short season, and that was the 1960 Olympic Games uh, in Rome. And he won every game by an average of 32 points, and he had people like Jerry West uh, and uh, Oscar Robertson as his guards. So it was an incredible team. And uh, but I, watching him, and watching the manner in which he treated people the way they needed to be treated, didn't treat everyone the same. Mm -hmm. Some people needed a thumb on the back, and others needed a, an arm around the shoulder. Mm -hmm. uh, to watch that leadership style was really a, a great learning experience for me. I thought he was one of the most strategically uh, well-groomed people I had ever met to understand how to take on a particular opponent and, and to do it with a way that made sense and allowed our team to stay in its strengths and how to uh, uh, cause the opponent to play differently than they practiced, which is really the essence of sports today uh, from a defensive perspective.